Dr. Stephen Badalak is deputy director of the McGowan Institute. His group has been experimenting with a new way to regenerate muscles and organs through stem cells, which facilitate growth of new tissue. Stem cell therapy has been having mixed results. One of the reasons that to date stem cell therapy has not lived up to, to its billing is that we have not recognized the importance uh, of the environment. Stem cells work as part of a larger environment called an extracellular matrix, or ECM. Think of an ECM as a kind of magnet for stem cells. Once placed in the body, the ECM attracts stem cells to the area where they can go to work building new tissues. The ECMs are made from animal parts in Dr. Badalak's lab. For muscle regeneration, pig intestines are often used. They strip a section of the pig intestine of all its cells, like staff scientist Scott Johnson is doing here. At the end of the process, it looks like this, a lifeless, empty section of collagen. But once the ECM is implanted in the body, the magic happens. If you put the matrix at the site of injury, the body's own stem cells get recruited into that matrix, and they say, OK, I know where I'm at. I know what I'm supposed to do. And when they move into that structure, they begin to remodel it and turn into the structure that they want. Keith is a perfect candidate for this procedure. He is therefore accepted into the trial and receives an ECM made from pig intestine. That surgery consisted of opening the leg back up where the trauma happened. And they then stitch a scaffold that's derived from pig intestine into the deep muscle. As the body absorbs it, it draws my stem cells to that area. Shortly after the procedure, Keith goes into physical therapy, and the unimaginable becomes a reality. Muscle just kept on going. It kept getting stronger and stronger compared to what it was beforehand. The muscle was about twice as strong after compared to what it was before. Here we go. <laughs> so I went from having a leg that pretty much was used for a little bit of stability and balance when I was standing still to one that I could actually use now. My daughter is so active all the time. Now I'm the daddy that runs around and plays and can be her own personal jungle gym while she climbs all over me and does flips and, and practices her gymnastics. So uh, it's, it's fantastic. When we see a patient uh, like Keith, is uh, almost impossible to uh, describe. In fact, I, I just got goosebumps now. I can say I went through a lot of hell to get to this point, and now it's blue skies again. <laughs>